o'clock secrets are oh, you're just in time thank you very much all right we have mary crossing and lurgy back online two and on line one we have Gronya mclaughlin in cold daft Gronya, good morning to you you got to laugh at me this good morning. morning you got to laugh at me this morning <laughs> i says i used to have a boss called Gronya mclaughlin and you kind of laughed at me oh no i just said i wouldn't be old enough to be your boss <laughs> So this begs me to ask you the question, how old are you then? See, I could be younger than you. I think I have a younger... Well... Well, what? As the same goes, you're you're only as old as the man you feel. (laughs) Gee, you macaroni. And do you have a man? Oh, yeah. What (laughs) you do? Well, you used to. What's his name? You're good. Uh, Jim McLaughlin. Jim. And uh, um, when's Jim's birthday? (laughs) Jim's birthday's February... (laughs) My birthday is retirement age. Oh, <laughs> you, oh, you're devil. What date in February is Jim's birthday? Mine's on the 14th of February. 17th. Oh, oh right, OK, OK. Right, right. Yeah. Come here, you work in the Fabric Centre or Letter Kenny? Yes, I do, yeah. Do you want to give him a sneaky plug? Go on ahead. Um, yeah, anybody wants curtains made or blinds? A roller blind so from I, the Fabric Centre, let you, Kenny. And as for <laughs> Gronya McLaughlin, who's only 22. <laughs> I wish. Oh, can we have a listen to this? See, can you win some money? Now, Gronya McLaughlin, on a serious note, what do you think that is? Oh, is it pulling, closing a zip on a jacket or a coat or a fleece? You're pulling my leg. <laughs> it's not right. Yeah. <laughs> You're full of laughs. Come here. Thank you very much. Do, do you snort when you laugh as well? Do you? Do you kind of... No, I don't. No, no. I thought you did. I thought, you, I thought I caught you. Come here. Good luck. Chat to you. Yes. Okay, thank you. All right, All right bye-bye. Bye-bye. Right, we're going to Mary Crossan and Lurgy Brank. Mary, how are you? I'm good. I'm good, Lee. How are you? Mary, you had somebody call on your behalf this morning because this lady spoke to me very shortly. She says, I'm passing you over to Mary. Who was that lady? That is my daughter. Yeah, what's her name? Anne Marie. Anne Marie McDevitt. She didn't give me a chance to, to ask her her name. She just <laughs> hoofed over the phone just like that. Come here, how are you? Oh, that's Anne Marie. Oh, that's her. She's I'm good. good. Yeah. You could nearly <laughs> roll down the hill from Lurgy Brack to collect the money. I nearly could. And I ne- nearly could. And you could get a taxi home? Or- I've heard one of them wires things, you know, you could put it, you know, the old ones they used to have in the shops. What? Put it up to the wee jar and do you know push what, it across to me. Do you know what we could do? We could have a zip line from Lurgy Brack to Mountain Top and Letterkenny. That'd be good, wouldn't it? That's the word I was looking for. Yes. <laughs> and you could take your dirty washing with you that is washed and could, they'll be dry the time they come up to the mountain top. Do you know all the breeze and the wind and stuff? Anyway, we better get into this sequence. Um, have a wee listen to this. And if you win this, we could we could go to the dry cleaners with their washing. Don't be worrying about any of that ironing or washing. Have a listen. Exactly. Be nice. Exactly. Be lovely. Sixteen hundred and twenty. What do you think it is? Lee, I think it's scraping a slice of toast. It's wrong. Ali. I know somebody <laughs> said that to me the other day. I think I know it's scraping a slice of toast. Mary Crossan, thanks for taking the call. Oh, you, you rang us. Thank you, Lee. All right, good okay, chatting. Thank t- you. Say hi, Tammy, from me too. Bye. Oh, oh, oh.